I think this is the better way to go. And even then, I think we're probably not screwed. We're good. <laughs> we're actually fine. Hey, how's it going? Welcome back to Balatro. So today we're going to be doing a challenge blast off, I think, is the one. So for blast off, basically, we have constellation, we have rocket, we have planets, we have a lot of space theming going on. So for this one, um, we want to make money with rocket and then buy planet cards so we can stack up constellation. I guess that's kind of what we're going for. Other than that, I can't really think of how the theming kind of fits together on this one. So let's uh, let's look for a club flush first. Easy enough. Should be able to win on this one. Yes, perfect. Exactly 300, so we're off to a great start. We get the maximum amount of cash. Uh, we're going to have tons of planets, obviously. So do we want to start out buying planets, though? I don't know. I feel like we want to go for uh, a good some good jokers first. Uh, I gotta go with Gross Michelle, man. If I see, I see a banana, I take a banana, man. I'm, uh, I got, I got the monkey brain. What can I say? And maybe, you know what? Uh, I don't know if we go two pair. You know what? I think we do. Let's just, well, we'll go, we'll go, um, whatever we kind of fall into. But we want to start buying planets ASAP, I think, is what we want. Uh, Gross Michelle is going to give us molt, and then our constellation is going to multiply said molt. So, let's just look for a flush. Should be easy peasy. As long as, uh, like, flush is early on, man. Like, the, you just can't beat it. You just got to go with it. Um, unfortunately, we didn't get any flush yet, but we will here. Oh, yeah, we have full clubs. So, that should be perfect. Should get the extra malt. Yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. We should be killing it for now. Um, hopefully, our banana either do never breaks or it breaks soon so that I can replace it. Um, let's go with... Uh, let's go with waiting. Let's just wait for now. Our, our banana is actually going to hold, hold us out for a little bit. So, let's just keep looking for uh, our flushes. Just need one diamond. Thank you. That should be uh, more than enough. Should be like 2,000 points. No, it's like 1,500 more like it, but that's fine. And we should be getting a lot of extra money now. So Rocket's going to give us $3 at the end of uh, for payout instead of $2. Or sorry, instead of the $1 it was giving us. It's every plus two every time we beat a, blo a boss blind. So that's really nice. And oh, we got Telescope here. This is perfect. So anytime we actually open a pack... We will get whatever our most played hand is. So we should probably focus on like a certain hand type. And I'm thinking high card. You should always really focus on if you're going for any type of, you know, single card or and single single hand type round is what I think. Uh, we're just saving that two pair just in case we need it. Did I only have two hands there? Am I crazy? Okay, well, we're going to have to start over on that one. That's my fault. I thought I had more hands than that. <laughs> Oopsie. <laughs> Yikes. <laughs> All right. Uh, let's go again. Um, let's look for a heart flush, I suppose. Or, you know what? No, we'll look for the we'll look for the flush. I see the two pair. It does not matter. We want to make sure that we get it right away. We won't actually get it right away because... Uh, yeah, so we only have two hands. Oh, so we have to get it here. Okay, that's enough. I didn't realize that. Okay, so they limit us to two hands. That's uh, that's a little rough, actually. Clearance sale's really good. Okay, for now... Oh, gosh. I wanna, I wanna buy this, but will I have enough after the next round, after the next blind? I don't think I will. I think we want cheaper cards first before anything else. So let's just look for the, let's just look for our flush. There we go. That won't be enough, and we'll only have one hand with which to get there. So we gotta be a little careful, and we only have two discards as well. It's a little crazy. I don't think I realized that about the run before I started. So. I was getting kind of lucky there in the beginning. I didn't realize. But now we kind of know what's going on. So be more careful this time. Mm, 
Runner, I don't know. It's going to be hard, harder still than any time else to get straights. I think we just go next for now. Discard two random cards. So, yeah. So, we have two of everything. So, let's do... Let's do a spade flush for this one. Okay, I got really lucky there. <laughs> I didn't... Had no idea what we were going to draw. Luckily, it was spades. Uh, lucky unlucky, because I don't think we actually will get enough points to succeed unless we make it a high... Unless we get, like, a high uh, split here. So... We actually really need a flush, and it needs to be high. So let's try this. Let's try a club flush. Okay, we actually did get a club flush, but I don't think it's actually going to be enough. We can try it, obviously. No, it's not quite enough. Okay, so yeah, this one's a little tough. We actually have to make sure that we get a decent joker right off the bat. So... Like, for instance, if we get, like, a nice scaling joker right at the beginning. Like, if we get, like, a supernova or something would be really nice. Uh, something that can kind of carry us. Or if we can get, like, uh, bootstraps or something. We can kind of... That's something we can work with as well. Because uh, bootstraps would synergize really well with rocket. So... What do you get? Adds one stone card to the deck when blind is selected. Not great. Let's try for this. Um, or like another another uh, gross Michelle would be nice. Cards played with spades or two pair. Hmm. I think maybe two pair. We just need something that we can guarantee points. Like we need to be able to make it through. Uh, we can take some planets to kind of start stacking this up as well. Okay, that's fine. That should be good. Initial packs and the next thing are free. I think we take that. So, we want to look for a two pair. So, let's just get rid of debuffed cards for now, mostly. See if we can get... Okay, we got a two pair right here. So, let's just kind of see what two pair does for us. Uh, not as much as I was hoping... <laughs> Actually, uh, let's look for a flush slash two pair. Okay, we got a two pair. I This might be high enough. It might be high enough because it gets more chips than the two. It's not quite enough. Okay, this one's, uh, this one's a little tough. <laughs> I see the challenge. I see the challenge. Why is it, why is it restricting me to two hands, man? Wait. Oh, these are banned, too. We can't actually get any extra hands. Two hands per round, two... Wow, okay. Four joker slots as well? Okay, this is this is getting a little crazy here. This is this is getting a little nutty. Let's, uh... Look for that flush. This is not going to be a high enough flush to get it right away. We'll still have to look for another another hand of some sort. So like a two pair, this should be enough. That's at least 60 points, so that should be fine. Okay, oh man. Okay, so the, uh, the, <laughs> the trick with this one is gonna be luck. <laughs> like, straight up. Like, there's no way we can actually, like, play to any advantage on this one. Uh, we're gonna have to go with this. Like, our hands are kind of tied on this one. So, we got that at 1.1. Permanently gain a discard each round. That would be nice, but we're not gonna, we're not going to be able to afford it. There's no way. So, unfortunately, we got it in our first ante, that voucher. So, if we can play a flush, that's what we want to do. So, excuse me. Huh. We actually have a club flush in the making right here. Let's get rid of you guys. Uh, is that a flush? Yes, it is. Okay, should be okay, I think, because of the extra molt. Yeah, yeah, we're fine. Okay, so as long as we can play a flush, we're fine. Oh, we don't quite get 10. Yeah, that sucks. Rerolls, two pairs. We can go for planets or taros. So, I think we gotta just keep playing some planets whenever we can. And you know what? Maybe in our cana pack... I think we kind of have to risk it. The other ones are bad. Yeah, there is no point anyway. Like, the rest of the cards there increase the rank of cards. Not great. 
helps us get like two pairs and stuff, I guess. But other than that, it doesn't really help us out that much. Uh, we want to look for a heart flush if we can. Hopefully we get two more hearts. Okay, we did. Because if not, like, we're kind of screwed. We're kind of just screwed. Okay, perfect. Okay, we're starting to, we're starting to get there. We're starting to get there. Uh, oh, and a telescope too. Okay, so let's, uh, let's take an extra planet, right? We should be able to get enough money by not this blind, but the next blind, I would say. Uh, we definitely want a club flush here. And it should be enough as long as we get one club, please. Oh my gosh, we didn't get an extra club. Okay, so I know we succeed as long as we get a club. So we just play this. And then as long as we get a club. Okay, we got a club. So we get the extra malt. Should be plenty. We should be... We should get, like, plenty of points there, yeah. Get over a thousand. So probabilities we don't care about that doesn't help us immediately jupiter is pretty good it would be nice to save our money you know what we're actually at the cap right now if we buy this so i think that's fine i'm tempted to buy both of these <laughs> or to buy the spectral but we're not going to do that because it's going to be a mistake we're going to wait till after this big blind and then we'll buy the telescope telescope is going to be real handy i think I could be wrong, actually. It might not be that handy. I wonder if you played like a like a straight flush, would that still would the droll joker still kick in? Um yeah, so let's buy this. We're back down to ten bucks. Uh we gotta take another Jupiter for sure, because uh flush is kinda carrying us at the moment. We must play five cards, that's fine. We're kinda doing that anyway. So let's look for the diamond flush first. Oh, we actually have the diamond flush. What am I doing? Okay, should be should be plenty. Uh, actually, it might not quite get us there. Yeah, it does. Okay, never mind. Yeah, we're fine. So we're at 1.5 from constellation. So that's actually not bad. But our only source of molt is from Joel Joker. Every time a playing card is added to your deck, this could be really good. I think we go for the jumbo pack first, just to see what we can get. This is really good. Um if we play less than three cards so that's that's not bad hold on we get to choose one what else do we got here we got fibonacci fibonacci i actually kind of like fibonacci here a little bit because it gives us more flexibility like we can continue to play flushes and we have a huge chance of it containing an ace two three five or eight which gives us just extra molt I think Fibonacci is probably the way to go. We only have four Joker Joker slots, so the more we can get out of like one specific Joker is is better. This is really good too, but honestly, Constellation is doing really well for us regardless. I don't think we absolutely need uh, any other Malt Malters besides Constellation. So we'll just kind of go with that for now. Fours don't count, sevens don't count toward Fibonacci. So we want to look for a diamond flush here. Let's uh, try again. Yeah, okay, this is perfect. So that should be fine. And we have... Uh, uh, we didn't have anything in there that actually worked off of Fibonacci. So Fibonacci's ace, two, three, five, or eight. Uh, this could be really good. Although, like I said, we already have a molt molter. This hanging chad's amazing. I still think that this is carrying us for now. It's giving us the extra molt we need. We could look for another Joker though, like Brainstorm, really good. We can use Brainstorm to essentially, we can copy Constellation. We could, yeah, this this could be really good. So we get rid of this because it's not as flexible and we take this instead. We can also use it to get extra money whenever the boss blind is defeated. So we just swap rocket over here. Is no, oh, it's incompatible actually. Never mind. So we can't actually do that. Uh, is Fibonacci compatible? Fibonacci is. So I think we copy this if we get like a lot of twos, three fives, eights, or aces, and we switch them around when we want to like, I don't know, do something else. You know what I'm saying? So uh, after boss blind, gain 25 bucks. I think that's actually a worthy skip 
first hand drawn face down. So this is pretty terrible for us because we don't get to see the faces and we have to discard a bunch. Yeah, this is this is pretty terrible. So we have to get a flush right here. Okay, we did get one. So I think we do want to copy constellation here. Yeah, I think we want to copy constellation even though we do have a couple built up for Fibonacci. We want to multiply this twice. I think this is the better way to go. And even then, I think we're probably not screwed. We're good. <laughs> we're actually fine. Okay, so Brainstorm actually saved us there. I was thinking that it might not. I don't know if uh, switching Rocket over here actually helps. Uh, I'll try that next time, if I remember. Uh, extra hand size, really good. That's insane. Uh, extra tarot cards, not bad. Two pair, we're not really... I mean, we could play two pair now. It doesn't matter. We're not playing flushes anymore. We actually want to get as many planets as we can. So we just got, want to keep stacking them up, honestly. Like, just keep giving them to me. Joker's negative. I think that's a worthy skip. Uh, we have a flush right away. So that's perfect. Uh, we copy constellation on this one. Should be enough. Oh, it's not quite enough. Okay. That's fine. Um, one more flush should do it. So let's look for maybe a club flush. I can't remember what we had most of in the first hand. We also have a three of a kind. We could play a full house. We did level up full house as well. Uh, let's, yeah, we're actually, we're actually in pretty, pretty hot water here. Okay, we got the full house. Let's try the full house instead. Should be good enough, I hope. And... If we get it, which we do, we're going to switch rocket here. See if that actually works. Okay, it's incompatible. That's unfortunate. Okay, so rocket incompatible. <laughs> so that really sucks. Oh, I think I already learned that maybe. I don't know. I think I did and then I just forgot. So, yeah, we want to keep, keep leveling up constellation. We do want to save up our money, but I think it's important to make sure that we're set. We're absolutely set. So a couple re-rolls here. Oh, yes. Okay. Erosion. For each card below 52. I mean, it's free anyway, so we buy it. But it's not really helping us right now unless we delete cards. Which we're obviously not doing at this moment. We buy every planet we see. Every single planet. So now Constellation's at 2.1. That's pretty good. That's not bad. We'll go next. All club cards being debuffed is like, eh. Doesn't really matter. As long as we get our heart flush or diamond flush. This is uh, a little unfortunate here. I think we get rid of one card and just hope it's not like a, a spade or a club. Okay. <laughs> I, I think that was the best play, honestly. Even though it was very, very sketchy. Okay, so it's not quite enough but we get the other flush here. So I'm a little bit scared, actually. I think we spend all our money next round, next uh, next shop, to get as many planets as we can. The same kind of thing that we did last time, but we're a little less conservative. Like, we really have to... We really have to get our planets going. Uh, we need this built up, because otherwise we're going to lose. So it's either lose or we spend our money here. Stone card, lucky card, uh, more money, fantastic. That's amazing. So this gives us a chance to buy more planets. We just buy every planet we see. Does not even matter what it is. So this is really good. This is actually perfect. Full house and a and a another full house. And it was a high card there. And then we get a straight flush. It's kind of useless, but we take anything we can get literally. For each remaining card in the deck, this is actually pretty good. For each remaining card in our deck. I think we get rid of Fibonacci here. Man. Yeah, I think we get rid of Fibonacci. I think we have to go with this. This The extra chips are going to help us out immensely. I mean, it maybe, it maybe I made a mistake there. Maybe it actually works better. I think we're good. I think we're okay. We can probably hold out. So let's just try this. Um, we have leveled up a lot of different things. We have two pair, full houses. Flush is leveled up quite a bit. So we could look for like... 
And what well, we actually have a flush here. We could just play a flush. See what that does for us. Okay, yeah, that's actually really good. So I think blue joker is better for us in the long run here. Uh, we can level up flush. That's fantastic. Another full house. Perfect. Uh, we do try the buffoon packs just to make sure. Like, this is actually really good. This gives us a lot of extra molt. I think this beats out blue joker. That definitely beats out blue joker. That's a lot of molt. So that molt is going to get multiplied by a lot. It's going to get multiplied by three. Uh, we just keep skipping, man. We got to keep keep looking for more planets. Like, this is this is really good. There we go. 3.2? That's fine. I'm, I'm fair with that. Uh, skipping for three levels on pair. I don't think that's worth it. We don't really play much pairs anyway, and it doesn't... Even if we wanted to, like, it doesn't really... Like, it doesn't help us that much. Come on, give me one heart. Thank you. <laughs> Whew, man, it, it feels a little bad with, uh, <laughs> with the luck involved to, to be getting these to work. I'm a little scared, I'm not going to lie. Our rocket's not kicking in and giving us as much money as I was hoping. It is helping us a lot, though, I will say. It is helping us a lot. I, I guess maybe I'm being a little hard on it. We have a telescope, don't we? Uh, let's level up flush. Flush seems to be the best way to go, I think. Skip. Let's keep going for more planets. I think that's fine. That's fine. Play one hand type this round. Well, okay. Um, we got to go for flush, right? So, let's see. We got uh, close to... We're close to a spade flush. Oh, I was really hoping to get it right there. Come on. Okay. Whew. Come on, man. Be enough. Be enough. Okay, it is enough. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay, it's 30,000. Okay, we're good. I was scared because of the one hand type, and we only get, like, one other chance to get... Uh, <laughs> to get a, a, a another flush there retrigger all played face cards not great straight flush we just buy it. it's three bucks for an extra times one that's what we think of it as we don't think of it as oh we're spending so much money on rerolls and planets like for the hands we think of it as we're adding another 0.1 percent to our constellation which actually adds 0.2 because we're copying it with brainstorm so it's actually a lot better than you think it is so like that was 10 bucks i just spent but it was 10 bucks for an extra per, extra 2%, 0.2%. So, really good. I actually think this skip is worth it because we could get a really good joker or we could get absolutely nothing. Uh, going to debt does not matter. Creating tarot cards, not amazing. Like, if we had... Oh man, I wish we had one more joker slot. So yeah, I guess whatever joker we're going for has to have more molt than what abstract joker gives us. And I don't see that happening anytime soon. Uh, let's go for another flash. Come on, please. Oh wait, we can go full house here, actually. We can go full house. Yeah, we're fine. We're totally fine. This should be 30,000 points, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, yeah, that's 60,000 points, actually. Full house is better than flush. So yeah, we should probably be playing full houses more often, but they're also a little harder to come by as well. Uh, two pair is also better than flush. Actually, I keep forgetting. Flush actually doesn't scale that well, does it? And four of a kind's really good. Okay, let's uh, let's just keep looking for planets. Six dollar planet is not bad. We'll level up high card just i don't even know why just because <laughs> maybe i should level up something that's a little easier to get three bucks again for 0.2 percent so we're at 0.5 percent almost so or sorry we're almost at um five times so once we get to five times that'll be 10 times the malt so that'll multiply whatever malt we have 10 times that's really good so for now though uh, we kind of have to tiptoe. So let's look for hearts. Okay, we got it. Got the old hearty flush. So flush isn't that bad because of the extra molt. Like, flush gives you a lot of extra molt compared to, like, some of the other lower 
uh, the other lower uh, hands. Two pairs, not bad, but it gives more chips than anything else. Uh, blind. Uh, I don't. I don't like this one, and it doesn't really help us here anyway. Straight flush. Uh, we buy it anyway because again we need the extra planets. Planet in the consumable area give 1.5 times for the. I mean, we'll. It was probably a mistake to buy that, but whatever. We'll take it. We could level up. I think we level up flush here because flush is easier to get for us. Extra money, that's amazing. We can re-roll again. I think we stay at 25. Next Joker, I think we skip for that. We're gonna have a we're gonna actually have a free negative Joker, so that'll give us another Joker we can work with. Hopefully something good. Uh, let's get rid of three there. Okay, we got another club, so let's go for club flush. Please. Oh, we didn't quite get it. Okay. So I say we try for we try like a two pair situation. So we're still looking for clubs. That's fine. Let's throw you in there. Two pair. I think it should be fine. We should get plenty of points for that. Oh, yeah. Okay. We actually beat it. So that's fine. Man. Oh, man. The stress of having like two hands is really bad. One extra discard. That's amazing. And it's negative. That's perfect. Uh, another tarot card. We can go for another planet. Let's see what we got here. Go for flush. Flush doesn't scale super well, but it's it's the easiest thing we can get. We have to go for what's easy sometimes. Uh, so we can re-roll a couple times here as well. Hopefully we find like a planet card. Let's just buy it and keep it there because it gives us 1.5 times. Mm, not amazing. I'm not going to lie. I was hoping for like another planet there. Decrease level of played poker hand. Now that's a little unfortunate. So if we play like one that we don't play that often, like if we can look for like a full house here, that would be really nice. Like another seven or another three. Mm, it doesn't look like we're going to get that though. Man, that's so unfortunate. Okay, we can do two pair. We can do two pair. Oh, we have an extra discard. Okay, let's 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 get rid of the lows. Let's hope for hope for a seven or a king. Oh, we got a king. Okay. We can do full house. Perfect. And then this will give us an extra 1.5 times. We have to get ourselves up to times five on uh, our constellation. So we're on anti eight. So if we can get it to times five by the end of this, okay, this is good. This is good. We get two planets immediately. That's really good. Uh, in increase the earning cap. That is really good. It is a little late though. I think we're gonna spend most of our money here. We just literally just need planets. That's all we need right now. You know what? We should probably, no, uh, we'll buy it and use it. We'll use it. Observatory isn't going to help us out an insane amount. We'll do one more here. Take a straight, sure. Uh, extra money, that's amazing. Do one more. Another straight, not great, but that's fine. And we'll we'll stay at above we'll stay above uh, s above 15 here. Double tag uh, doesn't matter. Forces one card to always be selected. That's a little bad. That's a little bad might be a little tough on that one okay let's try let's try a two pair just to see what it does for us okay yeah should be okay it's like seventy thousand points for that okay that's not bad so our boss blind needs at least a hundred thousand points i'm pretty sure so we actually should be good uh you know what we'll take this anyway i don't know it doesn't really matter all right, we'll stick with that. That's fine. So we're at 5.2 now. So now we're getting times 10.4, which is insane. So I think we should be okay. I think we're all right. I think we're going to come out on the other side of this completely fine. Because as long as we can play two hands in a row, like that's over 100,000 just with the flush. The only thing that could defeat us here is if the boss blind or like the effect of it like does really bad for us. Uh, no point in getting that. Mm, 
extra tarot cards, sure. Try that, see what we get. Anything that can make this easier for us. We can make lucky cards. We can try this. Nope, okay. We gotta convert maybe the queen into another glass queen. That'd be pretty good. Uh, we'll go for the planet pack, sure. So, let's go high card. We're leveling up high card quite a bit. I think it's just, like, reflex. I don't really, like, we don't really need it specifically. So, is the next run the bo boss blind? Yes, it is. So, we want to just spend everything. We need this to work out for us. We can't not have this work out for us. Here we go one more time. Get a Saturn. Okay, of course. We end on a straight. Sure. So, the best thing we can play here is actually probably two of a kind or a flush two of a kind or a flush is what's best for us so oh, we we have a full house in hand but the stupid jack is selected what if we what if we do this what if we do a discard okay it selected a queen so we can do a full house this actually might be enough with the 1.5 times oh yes it is okay Whew. Okay, we're we're getting through these challenges, man. We're getting through them. Okay, so we actually we only have a couple more challenges before we're at the before we're at the Jokerless challenge. Five card draw is the next one. So we'll try that on the next one. So thanks for watching. Appreciate you. Have a good one.